so I'm back. Uh, I'm sorry it's been a while since I've been on here. Um, yeah, I think like when you stop doing something that you pretty much do like every day, you just kind of like fall off the track, and I think that's what happened to me because I didn't I didn't vlog at all when my mom was here. So um, and then after she left, it was just kind of hard to get back to it. Uh, but here it is Friday. <laughs> um, yeah, I waited a week to do this again. So I again I apologize, and if you guys are still sticking around. God bless you. You guys are amazing subscribers. I really, really appreciate it. Um, so, here's Allison. She's eating her snack. Her morning snack. I actually just gave her a cookie. Like one of these baby cookies. No, not the best thing to have in the mornings. But we are out of like food for her to eat. So, I'm going to go out today and get some more stuff for her. And then I'm also going to go check out the new Hobby Lobby store that just opened in Jeffersonville. I'm super excited. I'm so, so, so excited. Like, because, like, um, the Hobby Lobby that was at, in the town next to us wasn't all that great. But this one looks huge. So, so big. And it's nice. And it's new, of course. So I'm, I'm excited. I'm going to go check it out today. I need to I need to shop for some more potpourri for my pumpkin I don't know I'll show you in a little bit what I'm talking about but I need to get some more potpourri for that and um, I'm gonna check out and see what kind of candles they have for fall I am um, I don't know if you guys know about know this about me but um, I am a huge fan of fall uh, fall is my favorite time of the year I absolutely love it. Um, I love decorating for it. I love the weather where it's like not so hot, but it's not so cold. It's just just in the middle. It's just right. Um, so I'm I'm super excited. I already have like my fall decor up, so I just have to get like just a few more things that hopefully I can get a good deal on the Hobby Lobby. Um, so I'm super excited. So, uh, let's see what else is going on. Uh, so, the visit with my mom went really, really well. Um, she stayed here for like four days. Like, she got here like Thursday night and stayed until Monday. Um, so, it was a good visit. Um, it was, it was, it, it was long enough. Like, it was, it was just the amount of time for her to stay with us. As much as I love my mom, but, um... I don't know, when you have, like, guests staying with you, like, it's it's always nice whenever they, they you know, they stay for a few days, but it's also nice whenever they, <laughs> whenever it's time for them to go back home. At least that's how I feel. Um, I don't know, like, I, I just feel like I can't really relax in my own house whenever I have uh, people over. That's just something I just need to work on myself. Um, but overall, it was a really good visit. Uh, she was able to... Uh, babysit the kids for us one night while Chris and I went on a date. So here is some clips from that. Hey guys! So we are on a date night. We got our... What did you get? Uh, I got the original frozen margarita and uh, my beautiful wife here got the hurricane sangria. So uh, one drink for her is going to do her in. And I'm I'm a lot bigger than she is, so it takes a little bit more. <laughs> it's been a long time since I've had any alcohol in my system, so it's not gonna take much at all. So yeah, we're gonna have a blast. <laughs> I drank this way too fast. <laughs> Faster than me. <laughs> uh, she's not gonna be recording for much longer tonight. I can guarantee it. <laughs> Okay, so we are at our second stop for tonight. Where are we at, babe? Main event. <laughs> main event. We're such parents. We went to a main event for our date night. Uh, but we're at the bar, and we're having our second drink for tonight. I am having, what's this called? Uh, uh, Tito's lemon, uh, Strawberry Lemonade. Tito's Strawberry Lemonade. It's really good. 
And he has the biggest bomb. <laughs> so yeah, we're having a blast. Good job. So if you can tell, she's uh, already buzzed, to say it mildly, and we're out of money. Oh no, we're not out of money, we're out of credits for video games. And so she's we're gonna go to IHOP. She's too giggly, so we gotta go to IHOP, uh, sober eat, up with eat pancakes. some pancakes to sober up. So I'm cooking breakfast tomorrow. Well, I'm having a wonderful time. Me too, we had so much fun. I had three drinks. I'm gonna cut it off for tonight. Yeah, it was a pretty crazy night. Uh, I got a little drunk. <laughs> I haven't really had that much to drink in a long time. I know it's been, oh, I can't even remember last time I had that many drinks. Like I I just don't, I'm, I'm just not big into alcohol. I'm really, really not. I can just, I'll be totally fine if someone told me not to drink alcohol ever again. I won't be about her. Um, speaking of, my husband, had a recent health scare. Um, I think it was like Monday or t no, it was Tuesday. Yeah, because my mom went home Monday. Tuesday, uh, he woke up not feeling good at all. Oh my goodness, are we are we ready for a morning nap already? <laughs> Do you hear that? Oh my goodness. Okay, I'm gonna give her some more some baby puffs. Um, okay, so he he woke up Tuesday not feeling the best. Um, he was in a lot of pain in his stomach area. It was just like all over his stomach and he thought it was his appendix. I didn't think it was his appendix because your appendix is lower. But he went to the uh, VA hospital um, to get checked out because it's free to go there for him. So um, he went to go checked out and um, apparently his liver isn't doing all that great. Um, I mean, it's not, his, the doctors told him not to drink any more alcohol, like ever. Um, but he doesn't have an alcohol problem. Um, I think his liver, I think it's just poor genetics. Um, he just has a weak liver and he, it can't, it can't handle a bunch of alcohol. Cause we did drink a bunch, uh, on a date night. So I don't know if that contributes to that. Um, I'm not sure what happened, but uh, so he had to miss a day of work on Tuesday and he just, he came home from the hospital and he just relaxed and he was on, on antibiotics. Um, he's still on antibiotics, like he's still taking some medicine for it. So, um, but he's in a, a lot better shape. He's back at work. Um, it's just kind of, kind of a scary situation. Uh, because when he went to the hospital, I didn't hear from him like all day. Because they, he didn't have any reception at the hospital on his phone. So I didn't know what was going on. I thought that he had, I was thinking the worst. I thought they would put him in surgery or something. And I didn't know what was going on. But I'm glad to hear that he's, <laughs> I'm glad he's doing better. Um, I was worried about him though, but uh so yeah, we're just gonna just start eating healthier, I think, um, especially for him, because you know, both of us have gained a lot of weight. Um, not just him, but me too. So I'm still kind of struggling. <laughs> um, I like my food though, so it's gonna be hard giving up some some foods. Oh, you're making such a mess! <laughs> but um, the minute that I found out that he couldn't drink any more alcohol, I he called me like when he was coming home, and I poured everything out that we had, which wasn't very much. It was two bottles of wine and a bottle of vodka in the freezer. I poured it all out. So, I don't know, because if he can't drink alcohol, then I'm not going to drink any alcohol, which I'm totally fine with. I'm totally okay, okay with. Um, I don't know. Like I said, like I'm just not big into alcohol at all. <gasps> yeah. So you won't ever have to worry about me turning into an alcoholic. <laughs> Um, so right now I have my cup of coffee. This is my drug. <laughs> Apparently coffee is a type of drug. I didn't know that. My husband told me that the other day. Who knew? Anyway. What? My goodness. I don't know if y'all, I don't know how much 
I updated last time, but um, Allison now has two teeth, so that's pretty exciting. I think she, yeah, I think, I think, I think I updated that because it happened before my mom got here. So yeah, she has two teeth. Um, she's fussier than normal. I don't know if it's because she's supposed to be getting her top teeth any day now. So maybe that's why she's fussy. I'm not sure, but um, I don't know. I think she might be going down for a nap soon because she is rubbing her eyes. Maybe she didn't sleep very well. Um, but this is my second cup of coffee. Uh, the girls are already off to school. Um, while they were getting ready for school, I took a quick shower, which was nice. So I had my shower and everything uh, before I took them to school. So I'm going to try to do that from now on because I feel more awake. Um, hair feels nice because I washed it really well. Um, so yeah, so today we're going to go... I'll show you what I have decorated so far for my house for fall and then we'll go to Hobby Lobby and go do a little bit of shopping not too much like I can't spend a whole lot of money but it'll be nice to just see what they have and yeah I'm excited um and then we need to do some grocery shopping unfortunately so I think I might do that after I finish my coffee because so I can just stay home and relax the rest of the day until the kids get out of school so that's what our plan is today, and yeah, so we'll see y'all in a little bit. Okay, so this is what I have so far, as far as fall decorations go. Uh, so I got most of this stuff at Hobby Lobby uh, a few years back. So got this cute little turkey, give thanks, little pumpkin, and these little things the girls made and painted, well, they painted uh, last year. So, this is Abby's, this is Ava's, super cute, and you know, I've always had that. Uh, last fall, more cute little pumpkins, and some gorgeous sunflowers, which is my favorite flower. Uh, and also, this is the pumpkin potpourri thing that I was telling you about. I need to get some more potpourri to put inside of it. So it's pretty cute. But then I also got that at Hobby Lobby. And um, also I got this table from the sunroom just to put some more stuff on. Got my pumpkins, got my F, little thing that I did. And um, a Scentsy candle, which I need to get some more scents for. But I might just get like the Walmart brand and call it a day. Um, that's pretty much all I have so far is, uh, oh, also, I'll show you my wreath. Sorry, my house is messy. And this is my wreath I have. Super, super cute. It's fake, of course. And also, if you go outside, we have cute little pumpkin and we've had that for a while as you can see it's already faded but it's still cute so that's what we have so far uh, also I have this little pumpkin picture frame holder a uh, picture of the girls from a couple years back so it's super cute and this is upstairs in the uh, where the bedrooms are at. Okay, so I just got out of Hobby Lobby and I'm super proud of myself. I stuck to my budget. My budget was 40, no more than 40, or I would have taken some stuff back. <laughs> And I only spent like 30 something. I think it was like 31, 32. I'm so proud of myself, yay! So I got some cute uh, like decor. I got some sunflowers, which are my favorite flowers. Um, I got potpourri, which was like six bucks, and like a little package. I could have gotten like a bigger like package thing that was like $20, but I was like, no, because that little pumpkin thing that I have isn't that big. So, um, so I just went the cheaper route. 
I also got a candle. Yay! I might, I'm, since I saved so much money, I might, I don't know, I haven't decided. I'm, it's raining right now, so it might not happen today, but I might go to Bath and Body Works and see what kind, what kind of candles that they have, because the more the merrier, right? <laughs> Apparently they have like a sale going on right now for uh, uh, candles, uh, like the big ones, uh, $12.99, which is a really, really good deal. Because Bath and Body Works candles are the bomb. Like seriously, they're amazing. <laughs> and the mall is just right down the road from our house. So I might go check those out. We'll have to see how the weather is. Right now it's sprinkling a little bit. I'm trying to decide if I want to go to the store right now or if I want to go later when it's not raining. But it might rain even worse later. So I might just go down just to get it over with. If it's pouring, then I'll just shop around a little bit. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see how the good day goes. <laughs> But, um, so yeah, I'm really excited. I saved some money today. I'm like really proud of myself. Um, so I will go to the grocery store. I'll probably go to, I don't know, I'll probably go to Walmart. I'll probably save more money if I go to Walmart. I'm just going to get some, um, baby food for the baby. Um, like some, like, toddler meals. Because she, that's what she's eating now. And... Something to make for dinner tonight, which I have no idea what I'm going to do for dinner. Might do spaghetti. We haven't had spaghetti this week yet, so might do spaghetti. That's something simple, something cheap. Um, so yeah, that's that's what we're going to do. So hopefully it's not pouring outside when we get there. Fingers crossed. I decided to go to Meijer because it's not as ghetto as Walmart. So I don't want to deal with people from Walmart. No offense, but people. The people who shop there but I prefer Myers like Meyer that's what it's called my not Myers Meyer <laughs> hey guys it is now 7 25 at night um we got done eating spaghetti for dinner uh kids are just kind of doing their own thing right now um, Abby is unfortunately in trouble today, tonight, because she didn't really get some good grades on her midterm report, so she's without technology tonight, so she's just upstairs, I think she's putting on some makeup, so it gives her a chance to stay off, uh, her iPad, Xbox, Playstation, whatever, and play with stuff that she has in her room, <laughs> so maybe it's a blessing in disguise. But anyway, so uh, so I just wanted to guys, I just wanted to show you what I got at Hobby Lobby today. Found some really good finds, and um, yeah, so here they okay. are. Okay, so first I got this beautiful candle. It's uh, called Purely Pumpkin, and it smells so good, so pretty. I lit, I lit it like maybe like five minutes ago, and it's already I can already smell it. So that was really good. Um, then I got like these stick-on leaves. Don't don't look in the sunroom. It's a mess right now. I'm gonna take care of that later. Uh, but I got these uh, stick-on leaves. You can basically, um, I mean, you can take them off and re-stick them in different places, which I think is pretty cool. I'm just gonna put it like this. And, um, unfortunately, like, it doesn't have, like, a double-sided, so, like, when we're in the sunroom, we're just going to see, like, a bunch of black leaves. <laughs> but we're not in the sunroom very often, as you can tell, because it's a, it's a, it's a mess in there right now. So, I got, it came with, also, I mean, it came with all these, uh, all these, um, stick-on leaves. So, I just put it all on the, uh, French door windows. So, yeah. And this was in the back. The, this was on my uh, front door. And I basically just, you know, put it there and then put my uh, fall wreath on the front door. <laughs> um, next, um, I got this really, really cute um, carved pumpkin. Just like the ones that the girls had painted last year, if you can see. Um, but this one, I have a really cute idea. I'm going to paint this pumpkin orange. I got autumn orange. 
which is perfect. I'm gonna paint the whole pumpkin orange. And then I'm gonna get some white paint, which I already have. Why isn't this focusing? Why isn't this focusing? Ugh, what's going on? Okay, there we go. <laughs> I have white paint just like this in my crafts box, so that's why I didn't get any white paint. So, um, basically what I'm gonna do is, with all three of our girls, I'm going to have their handprints. So, Abby will have her handprint right here, Ava will have her handprint here, and then Allison will have hers right there. Um, I'm not sure how good it's going to turn out, but it'll be a cute little fun project. And then like right here, down here, I can put like 2018. I'm going to be up here somewhere, I don't know. Um, I might paint this green, that'd be kind of cute. Anyway, um, so that's a fun little project that we can do this weekend, if we have time. Um, potpourri, well, remember how I told you that I got like a small package of potpourri? Well, I didn't realize how small little pieces were. And there'd be no way to be able to use this with that because I mean, it'll just fall, like, it'll just fall everywhere. So I'm not sure what I'm gonna do about that. That doesn't look too good like that. So I don't know, we'll, we'll see. I have no idea. I might have to get some more potpourri or something and use this little bag for something else. Um, Over here, I got these sunflowers. Uh, I got these super cheap. They were uh, like half off. Um, I think they were like $7.99, $6.99, and they were like half off. So, yeah, super, super cheap. So, I got three sunflowers. And um, I just put them in little vases. And they were actually pretty long. So, what I was actually able to do was um, bend these because I couldn't cut these. I don't have any strong enough scissors to cut these. So, I just bent them like that. And it seems to work. You can't really tell. So I thought that would look really cute, really festive. Super, super cute. So I think that's pretty much all I got at uh, Hobby Lobby. So I, I did pretty good. Um, the like I did, I only spent like thirty bucks there, which is awesome. Um, for me, being in Hobby Lobby, that's really, really good. <laughs> My husband was actually really proud of me too. He was like. That is awesome. <laughs> so um, for him to be happy about that, it's a big deal. Because <laughs> he hates when I go shopping. He hates it. Um, so yeah. So yeah, that's why I got a Hobby Lobby today. And I also got... Tons of baby food. This is actually like toddler food. But Allison, she doesn't eat baby food. Like, she hates baby food. So I got her, like, I'm, I spent a pretty money on this. Because this stuff's not cheap. But, um, but this will last her a month because she won't eat like a whole thing of these. What I'll do is I will, um, after I zip it in the microwave, I put half of whatever it is in these little bowls, like this one, even with these. I'll put half of what is in there inside these little Tupperware things and I'll stick it straight in the fridge and then... I will feed her, I'll save that for later, for the next day, and I'll feed her whatever is left out of these little trays. So they last her, it'll last her longer. So she doesn't, she can't eat, like, this is a lot of food. <laughs> she can't eat all this. I mean, this is for like 12 plus months, and she's, she's not even nine months yet. So I got her a ton, a ton of stuff. Like, these are her favorite. These are her favorite. She will go crazy over these. Um, she loves these. She loves being able to pick up her own food. So this is, I mean, this, these are awesome. So, um, and I also got her some yogurt. She's had these before. It's for eight plus months, which is perfect. That's what she's at right now. Um, like I got oatmeal and stuff for breakfast. I also got some uh, Cheerios, I mean, which can be also be used for the girls' breakfast, but uh, they, these would be really good for her to just snack on for breakfast or for brunch or whatever. So anyway, so, uh, so yeah, pretty much I got baby food and stuff to cook spaghetti with tonight. Um, 
So that's what I got today. Today's been pretty eventful. It's been pretty busy. Um, normally I'm just sitting at home, but today I was able to go out and get a few things. So that was nice. Uh, I am going to end my vlog here because I think it's pretty long. <laughs> I think it's probably 30 minutes long. And I'm really, really sorry that's this long of a video, but it's overdue. So <laughs> anyway, um, thank you guys for watching. Uh, we're just going to relax with the rest of the night. Um, I think me and girls are just going to hang out and possibly watch a movie. Uh, so I think me and Abby are going to have some mother and daughter time after Ava goes to bed. And Allison is going to be getting a bath after I get done talking to you guys. So, um, so anyway, so, uh, I will put up another video Monday. I'm going to go the regular schedule like I was before, like Monday. So I'll, I'll upload videos, um, Monday, Wednesdays, and Fridays. So that's what I'll do. And um, like I said, like they'll and then it'll be like at the end of the day, like Mondays at ten ten thirty, Wednesdays at ten thirty at night, uh, Fridays at ten thirty at night. So um so yeah, so uh you'll have a great weekend and we will see y'all Monday. Bye.